And how's it going everybody? Avi Optimal here and today we are opening up the brand new Lycanroc GX box. Now I've already opened up one of these on my channel but the Lycanroc GX card came in completely destroyed. So I thought I had to buy another one, get this card out as safely as I can, hopefully not destroy it. But this box does come with two packs of Sun and Moon, a Breakpoint, and a Fates Collide, so I did not mind picking it up again at all. So without further ado, I'm going to rip this thing open and we will see what we get inside. Now I won't go over what's inside too much because, like I said, we've already done this before. And I'll have a link to that in the description down below. There's the Lycanroc GX bot card. I'm not going to take it out of here because like I said before, I am not willing to destroy this one. We also get two packs of Sun and Moon here. Fates Collide and Breakpoint. We had a code jumping out at us, which we'll get to in just a second. We also get the Jumbo Lycanroc GX card. I love this thing. Sun and Moon Black Star promo number 14. Such a cool card. And of course, we get a Pokemon trading card game online code, which I will be giving to you guys, Lycanroc GX box. If you're able to snag that code, let me know in the comment section down below and be sure to hit that like button for me. All right, guys, we're gonna do Fates Collide Breakpoint and we'll finish it off with the brand new set, Sun and Moon, and see if we can get any good pulls out of those. But starting off with Fates Collide, see if we can get some Alakazam magic. There's the code for you guys. One, two, three, one, two, and let's get into our very first pack here. We're starting it off with a Larvitar, a Diglett, a Spoink, a Riolu, a Solossus, a Bent Spoon, a Dugon, an Energy Pouch, a Reverse Hollow Weezing, which is an uncommon, and our rare for our first pack is a, a Barbacle Non-Holographic. Hey, okay guys, we're jumping into Breakpoint, see what we can get out of this one. I also want to let you guys know I switched up the studio a little bit today, and I, fixed, I worked on the lighting and a little bit of focusing issues I was having, so if the video's looking any better besides the small focusing issues I'm having let me know in the comment section down below any feedback is highly appreciated all right guys let's jump into our one pack of breakpoint here and see what we got with a shelter drowsy spritzy a temple a clefairy potion a splash energy misty's determination a numal and a golduck non-holographic so so far we are 042 but that's a-okay guys because hopefully we're saving the best stuff for last in our two packs of sun and moon and we have lunala and sogaleo on the front so uh let's see there we go perfect all right but we're gonna jump into this sogaleo pack because lunala is my favorite out of the two team moon let me know in the comment section down below if you're Team Sun or Team Moon, or at least what game you picked up if you did pick any of them up. One, two, three, four, one, two, a new card trick. All right, guys, let's get into our first pack of Sun and Moon here. We're gonna start it off with a Growlithe, a Grubbin, a Zubat, a Torkoal, a Rowlet, an Energy, a Double Colorless Energy, a Dragonair, a Lima, a Trumbeak, which is just an uncommon trainer, and a Crabominable non-holographic. Uh-oh, guys, it's not looking too good for us. We got one more pack here. I feel like my light, my last Lycan Rock box was also kind of a disappointing thing. Like, it was really just purchased for the GX, but hey, we'll find out right here if we can turn it around and have some last pack magic. All right, guys, and let's see what we can get out of this one. We're going to start it off with a Drowsy, a Crabrawler, a Sandile, a Meowth, a Pikapek, an Energy, a Nestfall, a Dartrix, an Alolan Persian. We have a Great Ball, Reverse Hollow, and our final card for this opening. Is it focusing? There we go. There's that focus I was looking for is... Oh, a Team School Grunt Full Art Trainer card. Oh, that is gorgeous right there. So that is a great way to end this. I knew the goodness was hiding in that Lunala pack. 
Oh man, totally awesome card. No point of really doing a recap since this is the only good card we actually pulled. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and enjoyed this opening. If you did, be sure to hit that like button for me and subscribe for daily Pokemon TCG content. And I'll see you guys in my next video.